Yes, I'm uh, alongside the go-ahead man of the match and present that to yourself, Paul. Uh, now, there was a bit of debate, I think, between your, yourself and the brother of the man of the match. So you had to pick that up with Owen O'Donnell, who, who chose it on the night. But you did you did shine through in the end. Yeah. And I suppose your, your goal was uh, all crucial as well in, in securing victory for Lucan. Yeah, exactly. You know, like, We knew we weren't going to get too many goal chances today. Just with the, their playing a sweeper in the first half. And I suppose we were a bit, bit shell-shocked at the start when they got that goal. And we just had to sort of just keep plugging away at the lead. Uh, exactly, just lucky to get one goal chance and thankfully took it, yeah. Yeah, you know, when you look at kind of the, the, the scoring throughout the match, you were one down in the first water break, going into half time, two down. Second water break, you're one down as well. So, what was the message? Was just kind of just keep composed? Exactly, it was just keep composed and keep the scoreboard ticking. I suppose when they're, they're ahead, maybe to about 50 minutes, as you're saying. So, it was just, yeah, just taking one score at a time. I suppose in the first half, it was very sort of tit for tat, score for score. And I suppose when we, in the second half, we were just saying, when we get a score, just build it on with the next one and keep going. Don't, don't like to fall off the gas. And thankfully, we just got ahead eventually. And, Kept it going there. Was there any concern in the back of the head at all? Uh, like, of course the it was. Uh, they play a type of game, it's, it's sort of heart in your mouth stuff. Like it's, it was long ball going in every second. It's, they got one with the very first ball and thankfully it was the rest of the game were a bit more secure. But yeah, it was heart in the mouth stuff nearly every time the ball went in there. <laughs> but what was that victory in the manner of that victory as well? You know, you talk about kind of using that experience in grinding it out. You mentioned as, as we were sp speaking coming across the pitch there, you didn't take the lead to the 50th minute as well. So there is that experience and that kind of wherewithal to know you're able to manage games and you're able to see them yeah. out and you're able to kind of control the pace of the game. Yeah, exactly. That's, that's very important going to going into the next round is just getting through tight games. Uh, it, I suppose if you, if you have a hammer and it doesn't really do anything for you, you need tests. You need to get through those tight games in order to, to get that experience and build for the next round and get through, it, get through a tough semi. Absolutely. And how big is the belief, I suppose, within this group now that you can possibly go all the way? I mean, you're into a semi-final. Absolutely, yeah. No, we know we know the talent's there in the group. Uh, we, know we, have the, we know we have the 15 and, and the extended panel. Like you saw, some lads did brilliant when they came on. Don't really got a score. McHugh did brilliantly. So we know we have the, we have the 15 there. And we have the subs to come on as well.